He was the man in charge of Scotland Yard's response to the Westminster attack. This was Sir Craig Mackey speaking at one of the vigils that followed. People have tried to tear this city apart with acts of terror many times before. They have never succeeded and they never will. In the days after it happened, he was leading from the front. But in the moment of the attack itself, as the carnage happened right in front of his car, the Metropolitan Police's acting commissioner was driven away. Sir Craig had been to a meeting with policing minister Brandon Lewis and was about to be driven out of the Palace of Westminster when he says he heard an abnormally loud bang. That noise was Khalid Massoud, who'd driven into pedestrians on Westminster Bridge, killing four people, and then crashed his hired car into Parliament's perimeter fence. From his car, Sir Craig saw Masood run through the gates with a butcher's knife in his hand and stab PC Keith Palmer twice. Speaking at Masood's inquest, he told a jury at the Old Bailey the attacker had one of those looks where if they get you in that look, they would be after you. He seemed absolutely focused on getting further down and attacking anyone who was in his way. Unarmed officer PC Palmer died of his injuries. Vital seconds passed before Masood was shot by a close protection officer. Sir Craig said he'd wanted to get out in those moments following the attack itself, but his colleagues had locked the car doors because there was no protective equipment and no radios. He said, first and foremost, I was a police officer, so I went to open the door to get out. One of the PCs quite rightfully said, get out, make safe, go shut the door, which he did, and it was the right thing to do. That's when I thought, I've got to start putting everything we need in place. I was conscious my two colleagues were not police officers. If anyone had got out, the way this Masood was looking, anyone who got in his way would have been a target. But not everyone agrees that that was the right course of action. There's no protocol as such for dealing with an incident like this if you come across it, if you're not on patrol and sort of prepared and, and dispatched to deal with it. You just do the best you can with what you've got. But police officers are expected to confront and deal with dangerous situations, not run away from them. As Acting Police Commissioner, Sir Craig Mackey says it was his responsibility to get on with coordinating what would happen next. But as a policeman, his critics say they fail to understand how he could leave the scene. Katie Spencer, Sky News.